They're Republicans. They're Democrats. They're labor. They're management. They come from the left. They come from the right. And they come from all parts of the state. There's not very much on which they agree. But there is this. I find it accurate, um, really nonpartisan, um, unbiased, and it's a terrific reporting device that we use every single day. We really depend upon the state host news uh, to um, really uh, bring uh, to light and to the attention you know, of, of the public exactly what goes on here on a day-to-day -day basis. Well, I think the State House News is an essential part of the tools that we use to keep ourselves informed about what's happening on Beacon Hill. They do a terrific job of interpreting the events in the building and those of us that are trying to push a progressive agenda and rely on it to, to deliver and move a, a message. Virtually everyone in state government relies on the State House News Service, minute by minute, day by day, to keep on top of political discourse and policy development. The News Service is five full-time news professionals serving as the eyes and ears of our subscribers, an independent, in-depth wire service covering state government much more thoroughly than anyone else. The State House News Service is a very important tool uh, for us to understand a lot of the uh, goings on in, in the State House, and it's essential to us to be able to have, it's, they're, they're the eyes and ears uh, that we used to have and we don't have now because of cutbacks in the newspaper business. It's a really valuable resource. It's a good way to get a lot of information quickly each day about issues that you are likely to care about. We cover every minute of every House and Senate session and provide continuous web-based news feeds of every significant event at the State House. We provide comprehensive analysis of the coming week and the Week in Review. We provide audio, video, photos, a press release service, and searchable archives back to the 1980s. We're subscription only and advertising free. The level of, uh, of detail you get in the news service reporting is really unmatched by any other news organization, I think, uh, in the city. Law firms, lobbyists, government agencies, political groups, corporations, associations, our subscribers represent every ideology and pursue every imaginable agenda. They constantly disagree on the issues, but they have some things in common. People depend on them to know what's going on, and they depend on us to find out. I use the new, new service every morning and yeah. e every evening. Yeah. It's the first thing I, I look at when I open up my outlook, and it's the last thing before I go home on the train every day. If you ask me what is the one single source of information that I absolutely could not rely on, that I absolutely must have for my job, it would be the Statehouse News Service. After thriving in Massachusetts for almost a century, we're starting up in Florida. Like our subscribers, the two states couldn't be more different, and yet they have critical elements in common. They're big, complicated, and fascinating, and their government professionals can use a top-notch, round-the-clock surveillance organization. Massachusetts has had that for a hundred years. Now Florida will too. I think anybody in Florida that has an interest on in what happens at the state capitol there, um, whether they're a group like ours, an advocacy group that has, that are representing their members up on Beacon Hill or, you know, big employers that are interested in um, issues, um, they're going to absolutely need to subscribe. Click on the link to find out more. Sign up for a free three-month test subscription and discover why people who disagree on almost everything else couldn't agree more when it comes to the value of subscribing to us. I don't see how any legislature wouldn't think this was a, a terrific asset, a terrific help for them.